With this release of the Brain Trainer Designs package is an updated designs list. It explains new features included in this package and description of four channel designs and reports. Designs are named by category and listed in the designs manual. The categories are Alpha, Balance, Connectivity, Frequencies, SMR, and HEG. You can easily find the design you want by selecting Design, Open, and start to type the name. A list of designs in that category will come up from which you can select. The Trainer screen is Instruments 2 and opens by default when the design is open. This is where controls and training options are found. This could be a choice of frequency band or whether to do increase or decrease training. These options should be reviewed and selected before training begins, although many can be changed on the fly during training. The Client screen is Instruments 1 and is offered in most designs. In this screen, a green bar and graph indicate up training, and blue will indicate down training. Most designs have a music control button on both screens to turn off or on music, usually found in an upper or lower corner. If using two monitors, detach the client screen, then you can drag it to the other monitor. The Brain Trainer Designs list describes how to use the options available in each design. Frequency 1 and 2 channel require that you select one or more bands to increase or decrease. Difference requires that you choose which set of frequencies to decrease the difference or increase if appropriate. Some difference needs one band in which to decrease amplitude in both channels and one band to decrease the difference between channels. A number of designs have been combined to allow the same training options with fewer designs. Alpha Up combines alpha percent and peak frequency training and includes an option for the dominant frequency range. Balance Alpha Beta has the option to train alpha or beta symmetry or both. Frequencies 4 channel Squish Squash combines Squish and Squash with low, mid, fast, or squash options. HEG designs have a tension index included with ratio training for NIR, and video feedback has the option of play pause or dynamic brightness. Most brain trainer designs have options for visual feedback. DVD, games, video, and some with brain trainer head games. Select the design with the feedback type you want to use. An easy way to load any digital feedback except for Flash is to select Tools, Volumes, and double click on the object you want to load. Video designs should use silent videos. These can be downloaded free from the internet or can be made at home with a digital camera. In the games design, the Flash player has neural puzzles loaded by default. Load another Flash game instead if you prefer. For BioPlay games, press the Neural Puzzles button to switch to BioPlay. For Brain Trainer Head Games, select a design with Head Games as part of the name. 